Nine, five, boop. Come here, Sapphire. Cut, cut, cut. Nice. Thank you. And then you go, what's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we're back. The Hydraneer. Do my, do my thing. Uh, I had some excellent suggestions about people uh, who left comments wanting me to attach this track to this so that it auto like it auto sorts. I don't know. I kind of like this deal though because especially if you have something like say for instance the cloudy and bar cloudy and bar sapphire which we're making right now. If I want to get uh, let's just, you know 42 and a half. Let's just do this. 42 and a half, 43. Because there's no halvesies. No halvesies. So 42 and a half cloudy and bar and 26 and a half. I can do this. It'll right go around and I can just pick it up right here. And then was that again? 26, 26, 27, 27, 27, 27, boom. And drop it like through there. Otherwise it would automatically go here and I would just walk all the way over here. Come on back over, all the way over here. Come back over. Or I can just have it go around. You spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record, baby. Right round, right round, round, round. And then we got our weight here. That's a 43. So that's going to go second. I'm going to put that one on the right. And we're going to put you on the left. And we're going to put you in the center. Well, at the end. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's one of these that's like ridiculous. What is this? A 200 weight sapphire? Good load. That's a lot of scout coins. But we do have a very decent amount. Enough that we can go shopping? I believe. Put you there. Put you there. Bang. What an, what an ugly necklace. Tis ugly. Tis quite ugly. So, what we're going to do today is we're getting prepped up for tier three. We can do a live stream. I got I to do some digging. Got some things. I got a ticket. I got a golden ticket, and we also have 6,947 coins. Ooh. I think we can go shopping. I think we can get a big boy jam. Here we go. Necklace for my man here. Better take this. Better like it. Yeah, that's right. Ooh, 3,000 coins. Oh. Oh, we're so rich. We're so rich in tokens. Don't worry. We'll spend the ever living crap out of those. And I believe, which is the one that needed just the bar? She wanted like a seven weight Claudian bar. Is that you? Nope. You're the one that wants a core stone axe. You must be out of your brain. Core stones for the machines. We need big machines, big boy machines. Biggins. Whoa, 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 sport. And also, we need to get tokens for our tier three pickaxes. You're you're the one that she wants like a four and a half uh, ounce nougat, of core. A core stone. Of course. Of course she wants a core stone. Ah, yes. You are the one. 280 coins. It goes a long way. Drop it in here. Nice. Sometimes when they say thank you, it sounds like they're telling me F you. Anybody else have that uh, experience? No? Just me? Good. 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 And we've been cleaning up our yard because we must stay clean. Cleanliness is next to godliness, my friends. 1,790 in scrap. I'll take it. I'll take it. Where are my coins? Oh no, I've been robbed. No, I haven't. Mwahaha. Still 471,000 coins strong. Huh? Uh? Sensational. All right, to the island. To the island. To the island. Ooh, ooh. I see you. I see you. I've only found three more bones. So I'm up to 28. I need eight more. But now I see you. Now I need seven more. And that's math. And it does look like they respawn or they, they, they relocate every single time you sleep, from what I hear. Let me know if that's a real thing or not. 
Because I've been sleeping like the dickens. It's like, come on, man. Give me some refresh, right, bro? Come on, buddy. Come on. I found zero skulls. I don't know where I could find that one. Little help will do me. Eh, I'll probably have to watch a video or two. You know how we do here. You know. But yeah, seven more bones. And finally, that, that dinosaur. The people will enjoy it. The museum goers of that small town. All ten of them are going to love it. Okay. Up we go. We're awesome sauce. Let me just see something here. If they're respawning. That's where I found one of them. Oh god. I want to live. I want to live. Jeez. Jesus. Oh, jeez. What's up, Santa? Ha. <laughs> ha. <laughs> you want you want to dance? Huh, Santa? You, yeah, tell me about it. Missed me. <laughs> I want a train set next year. He always forgot. He always forgot to bring me my train set. I've, I've been a good boy. Been a very good boy. There we go. And off we go on the scariest boat ride in the history of boat rides. Apparently this guy got his license from NASCAR. And we're here. I have not found any bones on Mont's Island. I don't know if it's uh, a thing or not, but zero bones. Maybe I'm just unlucky. Probably a little bit unlucky. All right, brother. Ho, 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 ho. 4,200. That's a steal. That's a deal and a steal. I can get two of them if I felt like it. What are you? Slow moving utility vehicle for flattening ground. I don't need you. I don't, I don't need you. Then we got this, John. The lava thaw. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the, uh, I don't know what. Uh, clearing out an entire quarry, if you will. Not a fan of that. Gonna make some pretty designs. I'm a fan of this, though. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Crane up. Crane down. Crane up. Crane, uh, crane control. F. Oh. Very, very phallic. Uh, uh. Hello, my name is Diesel and welcome to my OnlyFans. Just playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. Okay. Crane up, crane down. Oh. All right. This thing is gigantic. Look at me. I'm standing there. All right. Crane control. I'm going to shift this over here. Let's see how much of a pain in the ass this is. Okay. Are we locked? Nice. Hit E to lift it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now this is a problem. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. So it loads it like that. Nice. So strong. So huge. Not the first time I've ever heard that. But up and up. Ting. <laughs> so big you can, the roads can barely contain us. Oh my goodness. Are you serious? Are you serious, Clark? I just want to go home. 
Let's back this up here a smidge, a tad, a hint. Stop it. Okay. So now we can haul anything that we want in the game, especially when it comes to those new mining machines, like the heavy, the heavy boys, the fat boys. You know what I'm saying? We have what it, what, it, what it takes. Just getting there is going to be a little bit of a task, don't you think? Just imagine I got to take that this up the volcano, for real? Really? Really? I don't know how that's going to work out. All right, and we're here. And you would think, hopefully, with a little bit more elevation, we'd be able to see a couple more bones, too. So that's kind of cool. I don't know. Into the fog we go. Watch out there. Hold on to the... Hold on to my truck, man. Hold on to my truck, man. Going across the bridge. Got a, Is there a weight limit? Ooh, that's right. I got a... We have a date with you in a second there. They're weird looking purple stone. Don't know what you do. Apparently you give some boost or something like that. Not quite sure. But I've always wondered the second that we came into this, uh, this, this island, I was like, what's up with these uh, purple stones that have a hook on them? You would think I could be able to crack them with my, like a pickaxe or something. Nah, nah. Gotta lift this bad boy up and then drop them all the way over in like the Broken Shores area. And then you drop it there and lava covers it or what have you, or whatever. And it gives you some sort of boost or bonus. I can tell you this right now. This is not fitting underneath that fueling station. <laughs> it is not. Down we... Here. Here, up. Up, Gunther, up. Now nah, we'll put it down. We'll place it there. Up we go. Act like we've done this before. We haven't. Just look at the scale of this thing. It's so stupid. <laughs> I guess it needs to be that way, huh? Now where's our core stone at here? Because when it comes to the machinas, our big machinas, we got 700 core stone. 400 Cloudium. I think we have the Cloudium. 700, yeah. We've got the Cloudium, but the Core Stone, that's the real, the real crap kicker right there. We need another 2 hundo. Easy. Ooh, that looks like we got some. Now, I'm not going to overly logify, that's a word, this setup. I do need to put something that like, cuts this off so that the stones don't fall down below, as you can see. That's kind of a problem. It's kind of annoying, but kind of a minor inconvenience as opposed to a real problem, if you understand what I'm saying. I just got to find a, uh, like a point or a place that'll just be able to turn it off. Probably going to be right there. Probably. But I got to loop it around and hook it around and Got to hook it around. You're a hooker. All right, let's go over here and see what we got when it comes to the core. Got a hardcore. Wicked and Roar. Hey, you know what? You know what? I think I just might have to take this with us. Into this beast. We'll have two adventures today. One, trying to get up the mountain, and two, trying to lift up one of those uh, purple stones. We'll take you. And we are off. I would love to mess around with this thing and see what it do. Let's just take a lava bucket with me just in case you need to refill this. Because Lord knows this is a lava guzzler. Catch my catch my meaning, catch my drift. You know, gas guzzler, lava guzzler. It's definitely something you got to plan for. It's definitely something you got to plan for when, when you add it to your shop. You're like, dude, if we buy this thing, just imagine. It's going to cost us at least $1,000 in gas per week. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. That's a lot. Okay. Let's see what we got to do for this. Boom. Up. Up, Gunther. Up. Come on. Come on. Come on. I think I can. Nice. 
we're going to destroy you. No. <laughs> well, I feel kind of bad. Just something that's been here. I don't even know if it's been here for quite a while. I mean, it's got a hook in it. That's not natural. This thing's meant to be destroyed. Now I don't feel bad at all. It's a good thing I talked myself out of that. Hey, townsfolk. Are you impressed? Huh, huh. Like, oh, Jesus. Not this guy again. Look at the size of that thing. He's already taken out three houses with his little truck. I mean, this is bigger than some... This, my truck is bigger than most of the homes in this town. As it should be. I also don't know if it's kind of deceiving or not, but I feel like this thing is slow as molasses. Not very quick. Of course, it doesn't have to be. Just the size of it. The sheer, the sheer size of it should be plenty. But it's not like we're intimidating any, anybody driving anywhere. Except for the townsfolk. I'm surprised they don't throw spears or throw rocks at it. Thinking some sort of like weird dragon. It's a monster. Kill it. No. Ma'am, chill. Put down the rock. Put down the gun, ma'am. Put down the gun. Okay, in town we go. Shattered outpost. Everyone run. It's a good thing I have this gigantic weight on your island. Hopefully it, uh, you know, doesn't hurt itself. So do I put this here or here? Oh, ha, ha, ha. something tells me it's got to go there. Eat it up, brother. Ooh, it's, ah, it's hot. Take the Shattered Outpost Renner to turn into Forge Mark, which can be applied when forging pickaxes, shovels, drills, and harvesters too heavy to lift. Ah, it's getting smaller. It's shrinking before our eyes. Shrink. 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 I get a kick out of it because even the metal hook, that even gets smaller. It's like, okay, okay, buddy. What are you doing here? All right. What is this, magic? Of course it is. It's all magic. I'll get you, my pretty, and your little dog, too. Oh, what a world, what a world, what a world. Ooh. A refined forge mark can be applied while master working to pickaxes, shovels, drills, and harvesters. Okay, so if I add it to this recipe, that means it's going to be even better. Only one way to find out. Can I can I do, can I do a little uh, three point turn in here? Is there a way? So apparently, with those forge marks, like once you lift one up out of the ground, another one respawns someplace else. From my uh, understanding, there's two of them that I've seen so far. That was the one that was closest to us, and there's one right at the entrance way to Vocalidas. Once you hop on in for the first time into the uh, the map. I believe they respawn once you pluck them out of the ground. But they're like added in some weird location. Kind of dinosaur bones. No idea. No idea where they're at? You gotta find them. Alright, so this should be a real treat. Here we go. Fingers crossed, everyone. Cross your toes if you can. Happy Friday. We made it. Rejoice. I said rejoice! That's not too bad. Feel like a bus driver in Peru right now, but everything's fine. Got that vantage point. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're cool. We're cool. Whoa. Hey, man. Hey, man. I love the stutter saves. Okay, this is a little, it's a little tight. Hold the boat. Hold the boat. All right. Oh, it does fit on the escalator. I mean, the elevator. Escalator, elevator. Going across. Now, the real challenge. Three-point turn in this, John. Oh, my goodness. Uh, uh, uh. Eh, eh. Well, first thing, we're just going to have to kind of maneuver this a little bit anyway. So, out we go. I don't know where I'm going. Boom. Let's take this pan. 
since I already used the lava that's in it. Need to fill up just a little bit. Need to top it off. All right, here we go. Let's see what happens. You. We got you. Let's see what this thing does. I have the power. Nice. Let's pick up our core ore. Wow, look at this. Speed bonus, output size bonus. And the only problem is, I got a question. How do I how do I install this? You mean to tell me I gotta I gotta lower it down or just drop it down? That's lame. Someone let me know in the comment section down below. How do I install this? Do I have to build a ramp for this thing and then it like I have to place it? Because that would be lame. <sighs> the trials and tribulations of this game. The trials and tribs. Speaking about trials and tribulations. What a pain in the ass. Drop this down. We got it. I have a feeling that that's exactly what you got to do. You got to build like a ramp or build a chute and then that's going to install it. Man, that's going to be that's going to be awkward. That's going to be a long time. That's going to be a rough ride. Stop. Drop. Set them up. Open up shop. That's right. Just like Evil Knievel, I get paid for the attempt. <sighs> oh, baby. Imagine doing a barrel roll in this jam. I think we can do it. Nah, nah. We just got it. Don't want to put any dents in it. <sighs> Don't want to put anything in it. <sighs> we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Terrifying the town spoke one, one more time. One more time before we... Drop this bad boy off. Uh, gotta make that tight little turn there. So tight. But yeah, that's gonna be weird to try and figure out how we can load this in. And it's not just that, we also have to get a big harvester too. Like, geez, how does that install? How does that install? I'm worried, I'm scared. I'm intrigued. And finally we make it back home. Unload our day's adventure. To watch those conveyor belts just pour everything that we love down below. Speaking about being down below, this is exactly where it's got to be anyway. So, down, crane up, crane down. Man, that is going to be a, that's a rough one, dude. I just installed it right there. <laughs> Get cracking. So yeah, you gotta, uh, I mean, so you gotta just make a hole all the way down to where we need it and then just let it drop and wherever it drops, that's where it is. But then I can't get it back up. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. It seems like a lot. It seems like almost too much. Seems like I should just make a bunch of tiny drills and then make a tier, th you know, make it down to tier three and then just make a whole bunch of these instead of dropping a gigantic, a gigantic loaf right there, you know, four or five stories down a hole and then where it's, where it goes, that's where it goes. Like, man, what, really? Really? Well, so far, everything's looking real nice. I wanted to try and put, see like a weight. There's a weight reader, so you can kind of put that next to it. But then I have to run an ex one. I have to plug into the left hand side of this, which means I would have to move these to the side. And I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. What are you talking about? I don't want to do that. So maybe we can put a counter up to the top there. How many nuggets have fallen into here? Got all these ideas. Not sure where they're going, but I got a lot of ideas. But I don't want to do some sort of silly elaborate thing with magnets mixed in with all this other logic. It just doesn't make any sense. It's not logical. 
it's not fun either. <laughs> Let me tell you what is fun. That thing's pretty fun. I mean, just the sheer size and the magnitude. This is what's not going to be fun. This. I don't, I, I don't get it. But maybe we can take a couple of the uh, masterwork or the masterwork fragments out of those rocks and then apply them to the small drills and then we can make the small drills kind of like big drills? I know. I think that would be pretty nifty to try and test out. We'll have to do that in the next episode, folks. We got our bad boy, our big boy, our fat boy. Yeah, we're hauling stuff. And we're getting into tier three shenanigans, tomfoolery. We got the tokens now to get all of our parts. We got motorcycles. Everything's outputted in the way it should be outputted. But I see like this guy. I think it's this guy's the brand new one. Speed bonus, output size bonus too. Okay. Where everyone else is kind of tiny, tiny. You know? If we can just add a couple of those masterworks onto here... So maybe we could turn this into a tier three? With like a big boy output? Big, big bad, big bad, big bada boom? So I gotta dig that way. That should be great. That'll be, that'll be sensation. Can I, can I get out of here? I'm stuck? Trapped? I'm never trapped. I'm never trapped never not trapped but folks if you enjoyed this video by all means hit that like button have some channel ever so much more you know and if you like it a whole lot go ahead hit subscribe new videos coming out every single day live streams every week make sure you hit the bell notification be aware of all the new content everyone peace out like shout y'all and i will check you out right here again in hydranir journey to volcalitus next time